Hey guys, it's me Jamie and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. So today I'm doing actually two books, two videos this week, which surprise, right? But this is a book that I finished in April and the first two days of May I finished it. But this is a book review on the like book that was released in April, You're Welcome Universe by Whitney Gardner. Now um, I recommend, okay, I, is it, I don't know if it's going to be spoiled, this is going to be a spoiler free review, and yeah, but basically I rate this a 5 out of 5 stars. I'm going to explain why in a little bit. So, it's summary time! Basically, I'm going to say that this book is about a girl who is deaf and she takes her tea gets kicked out of her school, and it says that in the beginning of the book, so it's not really spoiler-free, but, I mean, this is not really a spoiler, um, but she gets kicked out of her school and she goes to this new school, and she's just so treated differently, and she takes all her anger out on this work, but then a war starts, a tagging war starts, against this person she has no idea, so she goes to two people that she thinks is a person, but it turns out it's somebody completely different, and I always had this suspect, I always suspected that that was who it was. But then she gets thinking of all these other people. I'm like, yeah, it could be them. But nope, it was the person I thought was the first person. The first person I thought who did it was the person who did it. So this book um, was all about art and graffiti and uh, attacking more, which I loved how this was. I loved how Whitney Gardner, this is her dubet, like her dubet. How do you pronounce it? Um, Dubai um, novel. So, um, yeah, it's like, I think Dubai means the first book. I'm pretty sure that's what it means. So, her writing in this book was so beautiful, and I'm surprised that was her first book because, holy crap, guys, this, this, this writing is five out of five stars. That's one thing that makes it so five out of five stars. There are some characters in this book. You have me and Ma, her mothers. Then you have Julia, of course, the main character. You have YP, which is Yoga Parents. I really wish I knew her real her like, real name, but YP is like her nickname. You have Jordan. I forgot her name. I was like, I was gonna say Justin, but it's Jordan. You have Donovan. You have Mr. Kaz, and you have KFS. I'm not gonna say what. I'm not gonna explain what that means because. But it's KFS is like his name, so that's what she calls him. So KFS is also in this book, which you guys want to know what that means? Hey, pick up the book, read it. It's totally worth it. But I really love how all the characters had a really big part in this. Um, Ju Julia and uh, YP were really the main characters in the book. I thought, I mean, um, I mean, um, Julia. Gosh, I can't talk right now. I'm sorry. But, I mean, Julia was this person who really, like, she was really the person who was, like, the main character, like, the main main character. But YP also had a very big, um, what's the word? Characterizing? I have no clue what the word is I'm thinking of. But, like, she's, like, one of the main characters, but she wasn't as main as Julia, who is the person on this cover. And let's just talk about this cover for a second. I mean... Look how pretty this cover is. You see how pretty this cover is? But without the sleeve, this book's just white. Which, I was really disappointed on what the back of this hardcover book looked like without this beautiful thing here. So, I am disappointed on how this looked without the sleeve. But with the sleeve, it looked like this. And it was amazing. So, hey. I can do with the sleeve. Um, I don't dislike sleeves. I actually like hardcover books without the sleeves but like i like the picture on the like that but like it's on the book yeah i'm gonna break the sleeve i'm sorry i'm sorry but don't hate me you welcome universe by whitney gardner again five out of five stars like this cover wanted me to made me pick it up and so many like not only even a lot of people on booktube were talking about it but i saw one person on like on booktube talk about it i'm like oh i gotta read this i gotta read it look at the cover look at the cover like look at the cover so 
my thoughts on this book were five out of five stars like i keep saying i really enjoyed how it just brought out the storyline i loved how um whitney gardner expressed the writing in this book i loved how the little chapters started out and then i also loved pictures in here and i just loved how she expressed her writing and i loved how she this the writing is really something that caught my eye i loved every time i saw those cute little faces at the top um yeah i'm not lucky enough but I just loved how every time I start a new chapter, I get one of these little thingies, and that just made me really, really, really want to continue reading it, and it was a quick read. It took me a week, but let me just say something. That's, you know, a week? Yo, Jamie, that's not fast. I don't read at home. I have this problem where I can't read at home. I can't start reading at home. I'll pick up the book. I'll be like, okay. go play sims <laughs> but if i can do this then i totally can read at home but most of the time i read on the bus i read at school is more of my reading point so yeah so i don't know how long this video is but it's coming to an end so i rate this a five out of five stars i already said that like a billion gajillion times I hope you guys go and decide to pick this book up. I think I'm going to be sick again. I really hope I'm not. But, yeah, I really do hope you guys do decide to go pick up this book. I love this book, and I am so addicted to it, and I really hope other people go decide to pick it up. So, yeah, go pick up this book. Go check it out. Buy it. Read it. And tell me what you guys thought of this book down in the comment section down below if you've already read it. Or tell you guys what you have thought of it after you buy it, pick it up, read it, and yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do not forget to do not forget to give the video a big fat thumbs up. I can never say it on my booktube channel. I can say it on my gaming channel, but on my booktube channel. I'm sorry. But I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do not forget to do, do not forget to give the video a big fat thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you're not already like and love to be. And I'm gonna see you guys on my very next video. And do not forget to keep talking the game on. Go check out this book. Bye guys. I mean, keep calm and read on. Phew, I caught myself.